Hi guys, welcome back to another video. Um, today, I'm gonna talk about five things I love about Pixel Pets. But first, before we begin, if you're not subscribed already, because 75% of our viewers aren't subscribed apparently, please do consider subscribing. All right, so, so five things I love about Pixel Pets. Number one is the ability to make whatever you want. So, <laughs> sorry, I went weird there. Uh, <laughs> yeah, the ability to make whatever you want. So I'm, what I mean by that is you can make whatever animals you want. Like, yeah, there's, uh, there's dogs and cats and hamsters, right? There are also parts in the shop, whether they're official or not, that allow you to change up the appearance of your pets. And you could probably make like wolves, right? It's a, it's similar to a dog. You can make wolves. Uh, you can make raccoons, red pandas. We got tails for that. You could make Pegasus, um, birds, uh, spiders. If you're into that, you can make spiders and like moths, things like that. Anything you want, you can just like make whatever you want. Other things you can make. Like, it's not just animals, you can, you, can, you can make all the animals you want, but you can also just, like, put whatever design you want on it. I mean, mostly, uh, as long as it goes by our rules. You can also do clothes. You can make clothes, your own clothes. Whatever you want, you have, like, a free canvas to make whatever you wish. And, uh, and your own parts, like I said before, you can make whatever you want. And I, I think that's really, really awesome. And I don't think- I don't, I'm not sure there's any other apps that can do that. And so that's what really, really drew me in to Pixel Pets. And that will always be my number one of why I love this game. So, that's number one. Number two, I love that you can make transparent pictures, or take trans transparent pictures of your pets. And I'm gonna show you how to do that if you don't already know. Um, let's go to Popcorn's page. You see this button up here with the three, three dots? I'm not really sure what to call it. It's like, it's next to your storage, to the right of your storage. If you press that, let's see if it'll let me. I'm I'm on my blue stacks right now, so I can't actually do it. But if you press this normally for devices that aren't blue stacks, um, it'll actually let you save it to your phone. You can, no, well, you won't be able to directly save it to your phone, but you can send it to like, you can send it through a message, maybe to yourself or something to save it. And the, the picture will just be whatever your picture is for your pet. So, yeah, and there won't be a background on it. Anyway, the picture shows up as transparent and you can use it for making like your own custom pictures. You can put like your own backgrounds on it. You can put effects on your pet. You can make advertisements for your parts to put in like the Discord or something. But uh, uh, yeah, I, I really like that you can make transparent pictures of your pets. It really adds to the creativity level. Uh, number three, you can direct message people. I, I'm not gonna show you my messages, but if I go to my profile here, you can press, there's like a little message button here for you. Obviously not for me because like I'm showing you my profile. So I just, I'm able to set like who can message me here. But for you guys, it'll appear as like a button with a message. And I actually prefer, if you're like trying to report something to me, I would like you to put it in a message rather than leave it on my wall. And that especially goes for people who have guest accounts. Even though you have a guest account or an unverified account, yeah, you can't comment or do anything until you verify, but you can use the messaging feature. I, I love that. I love it so much. I'm glad that's a new feature now. And yeah, so that's number three, that I, one of the things I love about Pixel Pets. Number four is all the different ways you can customize your profile. I'm gonna go back to my profile here. I love that you can make your own personal profile picture. You can make your own status message. You can use different like codes and stuff, but you can change like the color, the boldness things like that you can put different symbols in but yeah you can you can do whatever you want with your status message and not only that you can change who you can trade or who can trade you I guess who can send you trades what they can trade for like you can turn off parts trading here so they don't they can't offer for your parts they can't offer for your closet and currency and stuff like that 
But you, if you trade someone, you still can do that, as long as they're allowing it. You know what I mean? So I really like that they made it optional. By they, I mean Sketchy. Hey, Sketchy, I like you a lot. <laughs> You're the best boss. And, and also, the wall, obviously. You can customize your wall with messages. You can pin them if you want people to see them first. And you can turn off comments if you want. Yeah, I, I just... I really, really like profile customization. Maybe there will be other customization in the future too. I've been requesting it. We'll see. <laughs> but yeah, uh, is that? Oh yeah, and bookmarks. These are some cool pets. Oh yeah, and this is my second pet right here, Friday. <laughs> oh yeah, uh, it's just super customizable. This whole app is customizable, honestly. It's so creative. And uh, creativity plus animals equals cute, awesome, love. So yeah. And uh, let me get on to my last point, which is customizing your room. I love that you can customize your room however you like. I don't even own all the options yet, but there's a lot of options. I mean, a decent amount of options, but so far it's still awesome that you can customize your room to whatever you like. Like if you're feeling dark, you know, you can do something like, like this. Wow, goth. <laughs> yeah, I'm emo. Woo, <laughs> edgy. <laughs> um, if you want to be like celebratory, you can do colorful like this with a cake or like this. So that's pretty neat. Maybe you want rainbows. You know, we got some rainbow options here. I think this is more rainbow. Oh, well, maybe not. This one seems more colorful to me. But um, yeah. There's, there's customization for that. Let's see, let's make my room. It's what, April? April, let's go, yeah, let's go with a, a rainbow, yeah. Let's do that, and I'll purchase this just for this video. And I think I like it too. So, yeah, you can customize your room. And the best thing about it is that if, you pe if people go to your profile, they'll still see your room customization partially. And I think that does a lot to help customize your profile too. That was uh, five things I like about the game. Or I love about the game anyway. I really like this game. And I hope you guys like it too. I think you do because you're sticking around and playing the game with me. Playing the game with all your friends and re recommending it to people. Um, I also want to say, we have a TikTok now for Pixel Pets. So if you have TikTok, like most kids do nowadays, uh, you should check it out. It's at PixPets. It's not Pixel Pets because someone else had the name, but yeah, it's PixPets. P-I-X-P-E-T-Z. So you should go check us out. I will be posting a little bit there too, but only for Pixel Pets, like official stuff. Not for personal stuff. Don't follow me there if, if it's for personal stuff. But yeah, so uh, if you guys like this video, leave a comment, like, and subscribe. We'll try to respond to as many comments as we can. We love you guys, and goodbye.